I'm already rolling. Are we rolling? We're already we rolling. We're back. All right, we're back in. I'm in Canada right now, you can see. We got a whole bunch of snow. But I got this old bike that's been sitting in my backyard for, I don't know, ever since I've been born, this bike's just been sitting there. So it was my grandma's, it's an RV90. And uh, we're gonna yank it out of the snow today and see if we can get this whole thing running. I mean, I don't know, I think I got my work cut out for me. These things are, Pretty old. She, she, my grandma and my grandpa rode these back in the day. They did like fishing with canoes on them and stuff, like just weird stuff. So I'm gonna pull these, pull one of them out, maybe both of them, and uh, we're gonna film a little get to uh, getting it back to riding condition. Maybe take it out, do some enduro cross on it. Maybe do some moto on it. Ride some hard enduro. Maybe ride it like. Put a snorkel on it and ride it in some water. So follow along, don't forget to like and subscribe. Let's uh, dig these things out. Head over to Duff Moto and get the build going. Things are like frozen into the ground, I think. <laughs> like frozen in. Oh, there we go. This is kind of where the, the roots of the Wilton family dirt biking started. My old grandma and grandpa, they used to rip these things hard, so. <clears throat> Get her back to running condition and see what the see what, see what kind of damage we can do on this thing out on the trails. You could almost fit another row of them. They're so low. They just load up in there so much nicer than a big bike. The All right. Seat's comfy enough. You could put a seatbelt on it and try. Hopefully he's here. Oh yeah, he's here. Come Duff, on. what up? What's going on? I got some stuff for you today. What would we got? It's in the van. It's in the van. Okay, check it. I don't know. Uh, I don't know how you're gonna feel about this, but <laughs> you might be getting your hands dirty. Oh, uh, that's okay. <laughs> We're about doing that. Let's see what's up. Whoa! <laughs> Those are awesome, actually. Oh, wow. We're keeping the plate, right? <laughs> I think we're gonna. I think we're just gonna keep them all stocked. Like just. I just need them running. You think you can get them running? Oh, we can make that happen. Yeah. Some fresh meats. Maybe some fresh meats, but I think maybe my grandma might have been running the gummy tire back in the day. Cause that thing's like pretty gummy. Yeah, we can fit some tennis balls in there and make that happen for you. There we go. So. It's a moose. We just rolled up. <laughs> we're at Duff Moto. Yeah. What What do the people need to know? Uh, what is Duff Moto? What are you gonna yeah. be able to do with these things? Yeah, so Duff Moto is basically just myself, uh, but we're doing anything you can think of. Uh, restorations, custom bikes, full race bikes, whatever you really want in that regard. Um, Spenny wants to make these things sick, so we're gonna make them sick. I know you made my 300 pretty sick for Outliers. Yeah, so good. I thought yeah, I better. Good. I might as well. I want the. I want the. The Outliers is 300 base prep, <laughs> but I want it done on these things. <laughs> yeah, maybe just it. one. We'll start with one for now, but maybe wanna, we can get both of them going. I want to see the action. So long day, just finished up with uh, Duff Moto, heading back to my house. Don't forget to like and subscribe. This is a new series. It's not really a vlog, but we're gonna get these bikes going. I think we'll have uh, two or three more episodes and then um, yeah, we'll get the bikes rolling, get on the trails and see how they perform. But yeah, like, subscribe, go check out my new merch at shopdowden.com and uh, yeah, we'll see you guys in the next video. Coming soon too, coming very soon.